Now you can add that brake if you feel like you need to add some more. Okay, then you just have the brakes. Right. But I bet if I was gonna look at the video, I'm at least five miles an hour faster. Oh yeah. You're on the outside, but what happens is um, the rear end loses. Uh -huh. There's a little, there's a little pump right there. Yeah. And the rear end, the rear end will come un, uh, uh, unweighted, and the car just turns and goes right into the inside. You're wall. saying the hump is more in the middle. Yeah. It's a, it's actually it's actually right after the apex. Yeah. Okay. He's right after the apex, I'll show you when we oh, get yeah. down. Very good point about the brakes because I didn't. I wouldn't have thought that uh, braking longer and sooner would actually help. you save. Oh yeah. And save the brakes. Oh yeah. Uh, you know, generate less heat. But I, yeah. I suppose it makes sense because you, you need to brake it from X to Y, you are zero, the same amount of heat. Right. But over a longer time, so I guess Correct. it helps dissipate that. Correct. All right. So let's let's see. And when you yeah. come out of here. Yeah. When you come here. Right here. Little hump. It's over hard here. to feel. It's yeah. right here. And so yeah, what right happens? There, right there. You see where all the dirt is right yeah. there? That's where everybody goes into that wall. Uh, okay. That's where the rural river goes. Right. That's exactly right. 
it rides on the bottom side of that hump. What are you saying the hump is worse when you're in the middle than when you are on the outside? It, it's the same all the way across the track. There's a big depression that when they paved the track, yeah. it just sunk down probably an inch, maybe half an inch to an okay. inch. It's not much, yeah. but it's enough that it's right at where you put gas back in. Yeah. And so as soon as what happens is people put gas back in, they hit that, the rear, the top goes up, the rear end comes up, it unloads, yeah. And now they just point right to the wall. Yeah. It is an undesirable behavior. So see, we're we're a good pound, two pounds lower across mm -hmm. the board mm -hmm. here. Um, and I bet you, I don't, I think I don't know if you're keeping time. I am, I am. So okay. I'm gonna take a look. Um, I have, I've been off my best, and we just have too many cars in here. So yeah. Um, but that it doesn't bother me because I'm I'm working on something you know completely different. But I think that once I do have the opportunity to actually get a little more more air time in there, I can. Okay. Uh, okay. You know, once it all comes together, right? Damn. Clearly, we're carrying a lot more yep. speed and down in three, four, five, yeah. six, right. um, maybe not nine, but that's a, that's a, you know there's not a lot of room for error there. The ten one is ten different, and into one as well. So yeah, I want you to be safe because again, yeah. even though this track is hot, there's still water all on the grass out there right mm -hmm. now. So we don't we don't want to be over in the grass. guys are watching now to see who leaves the paddock. Those guys? Yeah. yeah. Why the hell they're, they're so watching. weird about it? But you know what? It's never, it's never been an issue. We, we've done it for years. I don't know why all of a sudden it's uh, a thing today. Um, Let me just open the, the hood. Okay. Yeah, wait, let's just go. go outside. Yeah.
Everyone's been careful enough to talk about it. Yeah, it's been it's been good. I'm surprised too because that forward. What you want to do? I was just gonna move it to get to give the brakes. Uh, yeah, okay, but I think it's that will work. work. Okay. Yeah. yeah. What, uh, what how much understeer that was going to be, but uh, it was uh, just a little bit, but it catches pretty quickly. Within, you know, a half a second to a three quarters of a second, you, you have the front start moving up. You're going up a hill, and, and there's a little bit of uphill. It, it, it's not going to be successful. I've never seen anybody go bad. You know, where it came out on me is at the bottom of uh, at five. When we did the no brake exercise, I was, uh, was looking at the video afterwards. I usually go in there about 52, I came in there at 62. No, no brakes, right? So I just, I just uh, reach the wheel. It's understeering, understeering, and then it caught, and then the weight transferred, and the wheel came out, and I overcorrected. So I ended up putting all four up to the rest. But it's slow. You know, it's not slow, and uh, but that's a, again, that's a good. I it's a good get exercise. A practice because I want to understand what the car will do if I get out of sorts for whatever reason. Maybe the brakes are not working. Well, I'm, I'm, I like the exercise. So that's a good exercise for that. But do not walk away 
with some sense of hope that if you don't have breaks, that you're going to save them. Oh, no down or clock. Yeah, no, no. I don't think he I don't think he One, at least one you got to run off. You're not saving that car because you're doing 130 to 120. Yeah. Um, that car is going straight. It's going I straight. I promise you yeah. right now, you are not making that turn. And you really don't want to be going into those pebbles when you sideways, right? No, because yeah. that's the other problem that it delivered. And then it tells people, oh, if I just scrub it a little bit as I go around yeah. the turn, I can see that that's bullshit because you're going to be there. You're going to be there. You're going to grab it. Yeah. You know, yeah. Yeah. You don't want to go into that sideways. That's that bad. That's why 10 is bad. Because you end up in the pit sideways. Come around this right here. Push it, push it, push it. And now you're out. And you don't you're want to go like, I can get out. Yeah. Right. Now you're here in a gravel field. You go, well, what the hell do I do? Do I pinch it? Do I get it back on the track? Are you, and, the, and what people don't do is straighten it back up and just go straight. Yeah. This is where if you do enough skip bad and right. you get into some dangerous situation, you, just, you know that you have to counter it, not the other way. Correct. Yeah. Because that will that, that right. will bring the right. Yeah. So, okay. So, our, I think the next session, we'll go one more time today, me and you, and maybe one more time tomorrow. And Okay. So, yeah. All right. And then, um, uh, what is your next event? Uh, the August, uh, August best year. Yeah, okay. it's the August one too. Okay. Whatever. Um, yeah, I Friday, mean, Saturday. you're carrying enough speed that I wouldn't have a problem putting you up in white. Um, uh, they got some criteria. See what we're kind of doing. Yeah, let's, let's, let's work let's, on. I like working with you. Yeah, I like yeah. working with you too. And I, um, I, I and actually, you know, I, if, if I get a couple of sessions out of my own, let's room. check it out. Ten minute call. Uh, White one group. I like going back to the instructor. We'll go. You know, we'll go. So, yeah. you want to go back there? That's all right. Um, I want you to learn. Yeah. This is how we learn, right? Yeah. We're, we're not going to. session where I can, you know, see if I can put it all together and yeah, yeah. not push any more than I am just by being lighter, do the same thing, and, yeah. and I'd like to see where, where that time is, but I'm not going to be honest. That's a good word. I want you to do it again. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Instead of being very boom, 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 you're very happy. Yeah. Okay. That's Careful around here with kicks. Okay, alright. Good to know. Okay. I trust you. <laughs>